the record button. <laughs> so this unit, right. so we are going to be going over expository text and how to read expository text. One method I want to teach a talk with you about today is called SOAPS. SOAPS is an acronym. What's an acronym, guys? You guys remember what an acronym is? Yeah, each yeah, letter stands for a word. Yeah, so each letter, right, stands for a word. So SOAPS, starting with the S, we have subject. So when you're reading through an expository text, first thing you want to ask yourself is what is the topic, right? What is the subject? What is the topic that they're talking about? Next one is occasion. The O stands for occasion. Why did they write this? Right? What's the occasion? Why did they write this? The A? The A stands for audience. Who, who are they expecting to read this? Right? Is this something that's just written for like people in the medical profession or is this for a general audience, newspaper? Who is the audience going to be? And the purpose, what are they trying to do? Are they trying to inform you about something? Persuade you to do something? Or sometimes it's just to entertain, right? And then the last one, this one is the hardest one. What do we know about the speaker? So yesterday, remember we spoke about um, We spoke about bias, and everyone has their own personal bias, right? Do we know anything about the speaker? Or they, do they have any biases on the subject that's going to change how they write or how they talk about it, right? So um, I have this article that we're going to go over, and I want to first we're going to soap set. Did I ever change that to you guys? Yes, I did. So first we're going to soap the article. We're going to read through it, and you're going to be looking for okay, what is the topic? What is the occasion? What is the audience purpose? And then if we can, sometimes we can't always get this information, right? What about the speaker? Do they have any biases? All right? Let's stop. Aye.